mascots will it take to set a new world record for the largest gathering of mascots in one spot? A local nonprofit is now recruiting, well, as many as they can get. It's called Mascots for a Cure. Perhaps you've heard about them, but I feel like we have definitely set a record, at least for our KZI 9 News studios. Joining me live in studio, Derek Zinzer with Mascots for a Cure and all these amazing <laughs> mascots. Derek, you know, you put in a phone call. You said, I'm wondering how many my, I might get. So you kind of put an AP out. We mm -hmm. need mascots. Look how many showed up. Yeah, we have 10 or 11 here actually this morning. Uh -huh. So that's just a very small sample size of what's going to happen on Saturday, June 7th. All right, mascots for a cure. Mm -hmm. What is this all about? So mascots for a cure is a Guinness Book World Record attempt for the largest gathering of mascots. And it's so much more than just a silly record. We're actually raising funds and awareness for childhood cancer. So for every mascot that says, hey, I want to be a part of this, how does that work? They, they pay a small fee? Yes. Well, Mascots for a Cure is a brand new nonprofit organization. So we have our 501c3, our tax ID. It's a $50 minimum donation. Um, it's in front of 400,000 people up in Portland. Uh -huh. That's how many people come to downtown Portland for the Rose Festival Parade. And then it's also broadcasted live on Fox Television, which reaches another 1.4 million people. And you've done this before. How many in the past, how many mascots have rallied for this cause? Well, the first year we tried it, we had 16. And then I realized that we could go for a Guinness Book World Record. And we uh -huh. had 161 mascots. We missed the Guinness Book World Record back then by six. And right now, the current record is held by who? Tokyo, Japan. Tokyo, Japan. Um, Hello. We can beat that. And these are the real mascots. They're yeah. so much better. Okay. And then what, who are you looking for? You're looking to recruit right mm -hmm. now. Now, look into our camera. Who <laughs> do you want? We need all high school area mascots. I mean, there's 290 high schools in the state of Oregon. We need all of them to participate. Um, I've always said the high schools are the key to this record, and it uh -huh. still stands. We need all the high schools to come par par participate in this record. All right. Who is this? Because I fell in love with this. <laughs> I've never even seen this mascot. Look this is him. <laughs> TT Dude from Thermal Take down in California. And who else do we have really quickly oh, here? Oh, geez. We have Bottle Bill, uh -huh. uh, Maddie the Mattress, uh -huh. Dairy Mart Cow. Uh-huh. The uh, big head dog. We have the Toys for Tots yes, bear. Yes, we know him. Gordy from Guardian Security. Woohoo! Snoop Froggy Frog, uh -huh. which is the green. And then we have the AW Root Bear, All right. Pacific Cascade, and Dream Also Big. All right, you guys ready to throw some music on? Woohoo! <laughs> We're gonna party! We're gonna party! Ground floor, walk and play is what is happening in June 7th. We're recruiting. For more information, go to our website, kzi.com. We'll get you connected. And we're going to send it over to meteorologist Marissa Walsen. Beat that, Marissa. <laughs>